to my channel. It's a girl from Motoramano for those of you who don't know me. If you're new here, hi or welcome. I hope you do click that subscribe button to become a part of this family. And if you're returning, thank you so much for your continuous support. I really do appreciate it. As you might tell by the title of this video, I will be doing a hair installation video courtesy of Wig Encounters. They were kind enough to send me this beautiful unit, which I will be installing for you guys. So if you are interested in how I install this beautiful unit and how I do my makeup, do keep on watching. Hi once again, so the wig does come in this gold silk bag, it is so beautiful. You can even store your wig in here once you are done using it. It has some drawstrings there to sort of open it and as you can see that is my wig. It does come with a card over there and two wig caps. It also comes with some adjustable bands that sort of look like a bra strap. You guys will see that in a moment. Yeah, as you can see, it looks like a bra strap and it also is very stretchy. I don't think I mentioned this in the beginning of the video, but this is a teapot lace closure wig. It is 12 inches and it's also a highlight bob wig. I will link everything down below in case you'd like to get the exact same wig. And as you can see, that is my frontal. I don't think it has been bleached, but it looks a little plucked. So I did not do any plucking. As you can see, it is a teapot wig, as I mentioned. There are three clips in the way to secure it and also where you can add your adjustable bands just so you have a much stronger hold according to your preference. I just prefer to prep my wig on the mannequin head because it just makes it so much easier to install once I've done this. So this is me just preparing the wig. I usually just brush the hairs back, I add some got to be glue so that the hairs stay in place and I brush it back with a brush so that the, the front is more defined and looks a bit more natural. Before going in with a hot comb, I usually go in with my IKT wax stick. This just helps the flyaways to be tamed and so that it lies flat. I am going in with my hot comb now and you guys can just watch what I do. Tell me what your name is Tell me what you like and all your secrets I never skip the process of actually flat ironing my hair and using some sort of hold. For example, my AKT wax stick, it just makes a huge difference. Can you guys see what the actual front looks like? I really like that and also it is very flat. Also, always remember to use some heat protectant spray just so your wigs last longer and they don't get heat damage. I am going in with my Babyliss straightener. I love the straightener so much. It actually does the job. For the longest time in my life, I thought I couldn't straighten hair because of the straightness that I had. So I decided to invest in a straightener and my wigs have never been better. So loves, we will be installing our wig, but first we have to tint the lace. I use my foundation. You can use powder foundation, it's up to you, but I just love liquid foundation. I feel like it makes a huge difference. I can't help but feel like I've been chosen. I'm the one inside your mind. Keep going about your journey. 
this is what the front should look like once you've used your foundation it is sort of like a lace tint you can also tint your wig cap to further make it blend even better and make it look a bit more natural you want to just use some alcohol to wipe off your forehead where your wig is going to stick because when there's product there it doesn't stick so well I love using a razor to cut off the excess lace on my wigs because it gives you that zigzag motion that a scissor won't. This is what it should look like once you're done. Now I'm going to take my got to be blue. And I'm going to put it on the front of my head where I want my wig to sit because I need a firmer hold. But I'm also going to use the blasting spray, the got to be glue blasting spray. I am putting on my wig and I'm going to place it where I want it to go. And I'll let it stick but I'll also use got to be glue spray. You guys will see that in a moment. I really love how the front looks. This could use a bit more plucking, but I'm happy. It's okay. It's not too bad. At least we don't have that full front um, hairline, so I'm happy. So this is a part where I use the Got To Be Glue Freezing Spray or rather Blasting Spray. going to take my stocking and tie it around my head just so the front sticks so loves we are done with the makeup I'm just going to remove this stocking so that we can see if this wig has laid I really think I did a pretty much good job it could be better but like it's okay it's really not that bad so yeah we are done it is laid but the other side was lifting a bit so I had to do it um, I had to stick it down off camera and cut off the flaps as you guys can see so yeah I actually did this all on camera my apologies you guys I was mistaken so yeah you guys can just watch how I did that So guys, I'm just going back in with my hot comb and a straightener just to further style this hair. There is a little bump there, but it's because I didn't comb my hair flat. I don't have cornrows underneath my wig cap and I forgot to comb my hair um, nice and flat. So I've got that bump on the top. It is not the wig that looks like that on the top. It's just a mistake that I made, but we move. So loves, we have come to the end of this video. Don't forget to check out my discount code in the description box below as well as all the links to this hair. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you again in another one. Don't forget to watch where I model this hair for you guys. Bye! Tell me what your name is Tell me what you like and all your secrets I just wanna go over the details Let me inside of your mind I know I just met you But something tells me that you might be into Talking to a stranger with a tattoo Baby, I'm one of a kind
There's a reason we're here, there's a pop in the air that I love you and me could deny. Boy, I see how you stare up and down everywhere. I can tell you're far from shy. So let's talk. You're talking to me, oh, oh. So let's talk till we drop or till we get kicked out. Oh, you bitch, my touching. 